The Lives of the Saints by Father Alban Butler, October 10th, St. Daniel and Companions, Martyrs. On January 16th, we recounted the story of the five Franciscan missionaries martyred in Morocco in 1220. Six years later, six other friars of the same order went to preach the gospel to the Mohammedans of Africa. Their names were Samuel, Angel, Leon, Domno, Nicholas, and Hugolino. In Spain, they were joined by Brother Daniel, provincial of Calabria, who led the expedition. They arrived in Morocco on September 20th, 1227, and stopped for 10 days near Shuda, where there were many Europeans engaged in trade. On Saturday, October 2nd, they went to confession, washed each other's feet, and spent the night in prayer. In the early hours of Sunday morning, they entered Chuda and began to preach in the streets. The arrival of the missionaries provoked a tumult. The people threw themselves upon them, beat them, and dragged them to the presence of the Qadi. When he saw their rough habits and bearded faces, he thought they were mad. In prison, they treated them with extreme rudeness because they mocked the religion of the Moors. Daniel wrote a letter to the Christians from the place where they had stopped before entering Suda to explain what had happened and added, Blessed be God, Father of mercies, who comforts us in our sufferings. The following Sunday, once it became clear that they were missionaries and that they were not crazy, they were exhorted to abjure the faith, first as a group and then each one separately. But neither the flattery nor the threats made any impression on them, for which they were condemned to death. Each of the martyrs then went to Brother Daniel and knelt down to ask his blessing and permission to give his life for Christ. They were beheaded on the outskirts of Ceuta. The enraged people desecrated the corpses, but the Christians managed to rescue them and bury them. Later, the relics were taken to Spain. In 1516, Pope Leo X granted the friars minor the authorization to celebrate their feast.